with the news on what's ahead in daytime. This week's Soap Scope correspondent is Mimi Torchin, editor-in-chief of Soap Opera Weekly. It's March mayhem and madness, the emphasis being on madness, especially over at Passions. It's turnabout as fair play as Tabitha gets thrown into the loony bin with charity. Now, she gets we caught, Tabitha, now. talking to Timmy when he's in his inanimate state. Well, we've been through some adventures together. That's for sure. And so naturally, they think she's nuts. They grab her up, think she's an escape patient, put her into the room right next to Charity. Now, I'm kind of worried if talking to inanimate objects gets you thrown into a mental institution. I talk to my TV set all the time. Does that mean I'm next? Now, you've heard the phrase, don't get mad, get even. That's exactly what happens over at All My Children. It's the wrap-up of Colby's custody trial, and Jake leaves town. This makes Tad very angry, so he makes sure that Adam gets arrested. But if you think it's going to stop there, you don't know Adam Chandler. I'm really excited about what's going on over at Guiding Light. Vanessa is waking up from her coma, but will she wake up in time to save Michelle's life? You'll have to stay tuned to find the answer to that, and that's what I love about soap. You never know what's going to happen. See you next week, Lee. And in this week's newsbeat, it's awards time, and not just the Soap Opera Digest Awards, but the 52nd annual.